Hey guys, so I'm back with them. Um, I just wanted to show you what they look like in their new outfits. So first, I'm gonna show you my Elisa. Um, I think her nickname is going to be Momo. It was a suggestion that um, was made by one of the viewers and I think I just agree that's like a perfect little nickname for her because it means peach in Japan and I didn't know that. So thank you so much for the suggestion and um, you know, actual meaning of that word as well. So I think I'm gonna start calling her Momo and that's just how she is called from her family, um, her little sister and her friends. So anyway, Momo here is wearing a pink sweater and also the slip-on dress, um, sheer lace and a pink boots which I am in love with this is my favorite out of three shoes they're so cute and it goes really well with her um, so yay. and one thing that I really like about this girl is that she is cute but kind of a little bit different she has this kind of graceful uh, feel to her so even though she looks cute and everything she does she's not like a cutesy cute in a way so I do like that about her and that's why I think I keep seeing her as like an older sister of um, my little chica. <laughs> but anyway, so she is so cute. And then moving on to my Snow, she is wearing a uh, dress that was a gift item, which is so cute. I was actually going to buy this dress. Um, but I decided not to at the last minute because I had that slip-on dress and I felt like the laces were, you know, they're, they're same lace, but I just didn't, I didn't know if it was going to work as a, um, dress for the underneath the sweater type of thing. So I, at the last minute I deleted it, but it traveled with the whole package. So awesome. And she's wearing this mustard colored, um, boots, which is also very, very cute. And they just look amazing. Um, like I've mentioned, um, I've been kind of distracted by these girls, which is, I think it's a good thing for now because whenever I think about my, my BJDs, I kind of feel a little bit down and um, I can't really help myself to um, be happy about the whole situation. So I kind of is, or I kind of am very glad that these girls are still present and I can kind of focus on them for a while um, which is just I think it's nice um, for me to do <laughs> while this you know the whole situation just kind of settles down a bit um, also I think sometime last week I think early not last week um, I got a package from um, Etsy and it was the D DIY uh, for the dresses for Blythe and I got it off of Etsy and I think I mentioned it some time ago um, and it finally came in and I'm gonna be start working on it on Sunday and the dress is really cute and hopefully when I get home I'll be able to show you what it consists of and what the dresses or the patterns that I, I purchased um, I think there's going to be a lot of ways to utilize the pattern and um, kind of tweak it. So um, one is with the sleeve, so I can kind of make it without the sleeve and then, you know, change the length of the skirt. And it, I think it's just going to be really fun to make the actual one and just kind of making other stuff with that same pattern. So I think it's going to be very useful. Um, so I will show that show that to you guys either tonight or tomorrow but for now I think that's all I have so I will say bye <laughs> thanks for watching guys bye